Hello, and welcome back to Monster Hunter Stories, where we have got someone new in the party that'll let us complete this riddle quest. So yeah, we're, we're gonna be doing quests today. Gonna be a little while before I'm ready to take on the tower and the labyrinth. But it'll happen before too long, I think. Like, a level 72 Ratha is definitely good enough. And I've got this guy getting ready to go. He's got some good stuff going on. Yeah, that's good stuff. Uh, hang on. Kind of annoys me that if you accidentally say no to continue with this party, unless you make another change, it doesn't let you actually continue with that party when you back out completely. But whatever. Since we're in the area, let's go take on the Kezu that we've been tasked to destroy. I've actually, uh, as you can see, I've got a new weapon from uh, Seregiosis. Also, I've got a Seregios on my team. That's a thing. But I haven't done a single quest since the last time, so you haven't missed any of those. I haven't fought a high rank bull drone before, I think I might as well do it. Oh, that's right, it's cold. Hmm. Let's do poison spike there, buddy. Oh. Well, at least he's not losing the head-to-head. -head. By the way, I've got a charm that's giving me these heals every round, so... That's where those are coming from. His health isn't doing so hot, but thankfully we'll get to heal him after this. And there we go. Oh boy, a twisted bulldrum tusk. It's always fun to try and pronounce the abbreviated names for things. That's where we came from. I've also upgraded my armor a little bit because I have fought a couple high rank Joes. Turns out Dynamo makes pretty quick work of them. So we might actually be able to deal with the pair of Joes. It would certainly be more dangerous because it's a pair, but if we can get rid of one, then we can get rid of the other pretty easily. Why you gotta use Sav Thunder Breath on me, huh? This Kezu is really trying to knock me down and it's really not gonna ever work. Yeah, 
Yeah, well, let's just sky high dive. Someone's almost dead. And it's not me. And there we go. We have defeated the unmentionable. See what we can get in here. Nope. Nah. -uh. That's better. Still just a Kezu, but it is better than a Lagambi or a Bulldrome. It's also better than a Popo, which it could have been thinking on it. Glad it wasn't a Kira Popo. I don't need a Popo. Oops. Always feels bad to get the just straight up and down takeoff. I wonder. Will there be any new quests for me in the rock baths? I doubt there will be, but it's worth a look. Yeah, I'm not seeing nothing. No quests, but that's fine. So let's go to Albarax now. Though I should have gone to the desert itself rather than Albarax because that's what we really need. Because there's quests for us to do out in the desert. So, out to the desert we go. Probably should have rested out of bed, but as you just saw, I do have plenty of donuts. I bought, like, yeah, I bought 250 of every type I could buy, just because. There's no real reason to buy different ones, because they all have the exact same effect. But I guess it feels nice to have different ones? I don't know. Another thing I did off camera is I changed a few of Ratha's genes to make him a little bit more effective. Though I made a mistake when I gave him Gather Breath. Wait, what? Oh. Yeah, made a mistake when I gave Wrath a Gather Breath, because sure, it increases the damage of Breath attacks for one turn, but he so very rarely chooses to actually use a Breath attack after it, I find myself just dropping so much kinship on it. Okay. I mean, I know it was a lowering spider, but wow. 
That was not a long battle. I guess. Didn't get a chance there. Depends. Oh. What's it doing there? Oh, okay. Sure. And now for a bit of a more challenging task. We got to go fight a high rank Diablos. But really what I'd like to fight is a high rank Black Blos, because if I got more Black Blos parts, I could upgrade something. I think this armor. But definitely something would be upgradable. To find a high rank black blows, I'd have to go into a lot of rare dens and just get lucky. That's the best way I know of. And unfortunately, it's not a very good way. Could have taken a shortcut by dropping down from there, but then we wouldn't have gotten those two carbolite. Not that that really matters. Carbolite is everywhere. What I'd really like is to get a really nice charm. Hi. Okay, let's use Dynamo here. Dynamo can handle this thing no problem. Especially if it keeps choosing Thunder Double Fang, because Thunder Double Fang is strong. Now, keep using Thunder Double Fang. Use what works. This ought to do some damage. And we get the kinship right back. Not all of it, but a good chunk. Oh, you finally chose something other than power. I dare say it's time for me to do some healing. I still need to get a Leviathan stem. Golden ore nodes are very worth gathering at. Nope. Yeah, I'll take it. 
So what would this be? For it to be a flying wyvern, but quite light. Don't think it's the right colors to be Rathian. Humble flying wyvern. So, oh, it's a regular Diablos. That's what it would be. So next up, we head to the plains so that we can deal with that Tigrex. I also need to get a lot of high rank Rathian parts so that I can actually upgrade my Rathian Sword and Shield. Because it's a really good weapon when fully upgraded. And I, I like being able to do Noxious Poison. And it's one of now two weapons that can do it, because there's a, a great sword that you can get from one of the downloadable arena tournament thingies that also does Noxious Poison. Does this quest just not want us to actually get into nests? Is that what's going on here? I've ridden a Brute Tigrex. I don't know why they try and make this look so intimidating. I mean, sure, this quest was probably available well before I could ride a Brute Tigrex, but it doesn't change that I've already done it. I'm going to go ahead and paint this thing right now, even though I'm pretty sure you can't actually end up killing it. Just want to make sure. All right, Tigrex, run away. Yeah. Pretty sure I didn't need the paintball. Well, you should have imagined it. I'm wearing a devil, Joe. Come on. sense. back to Riverto, considering it's right this way. The 
probably actually could get a decent way up the tower with just the monsties I've got right now. Yeah, I bet I could, and it's very rewarding to climb the tower, so... Yeah. Not the right room. Needed to go in the blue door, not the red one. Oops. There we go. I forgot what that cat asked me to do, but I'm sure I'll get to it at some point. Sarios. we got okay I guess not too much um, but I do know that Geo Fulcrite has got some quests for us or at least a quest oh hey if only I had gotten that quest earlier it would already be completed I've hunted quite a few Seregiosis Let's do an ore stone chunk and another ore stone chunk because it's what we've got more of. It's a shame delivery quests don't give XP. Even if you're delivering stuff that originally came from monsters. It does give cash and other stuff, so that's nice. And hey, we'll be able to turn in our bottle cap quest now. Okay, just one more quest board quest left at the moment. Though I'm pretty sure more will be added as we fight more high rank monsters. Got your bottle caps, buddy. Okay. Sure. Now we've got a quest to go to each of the two post-game areas. Didn't we? 
Yeah, we had another quest to turn in in the Scrivener's place because we killed that Kezu. Uh, yeah, it was Kezu. I should actually use nutriments at some point. Hi, hi. And what do you want now? Ooh. Group healing advanced. I bet that lets us make dust of life. That'd be nice. of life is good stuff but kind of hard to come by We should probably also go back to Albarax and turn in the quest for that Diablos. And then after that, we can head to Geofulcrite. I believe Kopni also has quests for us. I could be wrong on that front. We may have already done them, I don't recall. Hi. Still gonna head on over to Geofulcrite. And there it is. I'm betting high rank Agnactor. Oh, snap. Yeah, I can drive it off. Try not to damage the volcano too much. This man knows what he needs to be worried about. And it ain't me. We'll go ahead and take the boat to Kwapni. Because that way we can be sure that no one here on this lower path has anything they want us to do. Though Cheval has a quest line that we're going to want to do. I think that starts in Hakum, though. Oh, or it starts right here. That's fine. You got it, buddy. Hope you're ready to go down. It's not just another rider, Naviru. It's Cheval. You know his name. That's supposed to be Rathy, not just Rathian. Come on, game. Did you just bomb my Rathalos?
Bit of a jerk move there, Cheval. Okay. Ratha needs some help. So let's get him some help. Bit late to be using an armor skin, isn't it? Seems they'll probably be using their scorching slice, but that's fine. Doesn't hurt that much. Okay, can we win here? Ooh, yes. So, Cheval's gonna have a bad time right now. Like she's beating me on this one. Ooh, took a heart. If I was using Dynamo, it would have been so much easier. Spread Shock Breath works wonders in PvP type scenarios. Well then, I guess we'll be fighting him there too. Plenty of vitality nutriments. Shame those are my least favorite kinds. up because we did lose a heart. I do believe there are some quests for us over in this direction. And sure enough, there's a quest. What would that be? Oh. Yeah, sure. Especially if you're giving me an ancient panacea for it. That's good stuff. Oh, and there's another quest. Ooh. Oh, this is going to be a low rank one. Missed another quest, I guess. But that's fine. I can deal with a low rank ivory laggy. No problem. How's it going, Avinia? Oh, that's good. Oh. oh, it's the... that. I've found him before. So now we've finally got a quest up here. This is the quest I was remembering being up here. It's Cheval. I sure did. Alright, you're still gonna lose. In fact, I'm gonna see to it that you lose even harder. What training in Awa Valley? How long did it take me to get here? Again, Naviru. His name is Cheval. You know this. Alright, Dynamo, let's ruin them. Yeah, sure, you can use a power attack, that's fine. Show them what a spread shock breath looks like. Go, go. 
Yeah, it doesn't look nice, does it? Yeah, I can't have Dynamo do anything in particular right now. Um, yeah, let's just go for an attack here. Yeah, power attack should be fi Oh, it's not so fine. Why are you using burn chaser when you haven't inflicted a burn, huh? Come on, man. You're doing stuff in the wrong order here. Ooh, thunder double fang. That'll work up wonders. Let's get some health here. Okay, looks like they are using Scorching Slice, so I should probably get Dynamo's health up. He is a little weak. Oh, I guess we're fine then. Quick is a very useful skill. A little bit late there, Cheval. Also time for you to have another bad day. We didn't lose a heart that time, though I believe I did use a few more healing items. Yeah, Alborax is kind of nice. Now, defense nutriments, those I enjoy. Because, I mean, if we look at our monsties... I guess it's not huge, but an extra 20 points of defense is about the highest percentage that we can hope for. Like, it's the highest boost relative to what they've already got. Because we could do an extra 30 points of HP, which, I mean, even for our guys that are right around level 50, it's not a huge amount. It's significantly less than 10%. But an extra 20 defense for any of our monsters is nearing 10%. And an extra 10 attack is like nothing for any of them. Especially not Dynamo. Holy hell, Dynamo. That attack stat. I'm just gonna check up here, make sure there's no quests for us. Sure enough, there's no quests for us. Actually, I'm just gonna go all the way to the edge. Gotta make absolutely certain. Okay, now we are absolutely certain. So, where's my next stop? Um. I guess we're going back to the desert. And then we'll take care of that Monoblos, and then we'll go to Alborax and take care of that Cheval. won't be the first Monoblos I've defeated because I was scouring the desert for nests when I was trying to get a uh, Sandberryoth egg. I also got a couple Monoblos eggs. You're not even in a den. What's your deal? Oh, we'll have Dynamo do his thing here. That thing being 
Thunder Double Fang. Oh! Trying to get tricky, are we? And unfortunately, Monoblos can use any type of attack as like a command attack, like technical blow, power blow, etc. So we can't just count on always winning our head-to-heads. But it looks like this thing really wants to use tech. So let's try Electrified Impact, see how that works for us. Watch it use speed now. Oh no, it's using more tech, that's good. Yeah, when we win the head-to-heads, we do lots of damage. But we need to win the head-to-heads is the thing. What, have you just switched to power? Do you do that when you get enraged? Is that how this goes? Let's see if that's how this goes. That's not how this goes, okay. Well then, let's use this while we can. Okay, there we go. Thankfully, we do have the brute force required. will heal up and then we'll take care of Cheval once more. Incidentally, I've done the Platinum Arena at this point, and in the Platinum Arena, Cheval is the final boss type deal. And in there, his party is much stronger than it is in, like, any of these quests that we do to fight him. And his Rathi is actually named Rathi in the arena. So that's a thing. Pretty sure Cheval shows up at the end of that bridge, but first we're gonna go turn in the Monoblos quest. Yeah, I did. Okay, so let us find Cheval and show him a bad time yet again. Oh, maybe what shows up down here is the Melinx when it's this place's turn to have it. That would make some sense. Uh, that means we've stuck. Oh, there he is. Hi. Hey, buddy. You ready to lose again? Sure will. Ooh, we get an outfit and strength nutriments. Seriously, Naviru, show some respect. We know his name. Ooh, she's learned spread fire breath. That can get nasty if left unchecked.
But she's having a bad time right now. Not a hugely bad time, but a bad time. So now let's use Spread Shock Breath as much as we can. Because it will do wonders for us. Next one ought to get us a double KO, depending on whether or not Cheval uses a group healing. And he didn't use any kind of healing. So, double KO incoming. And now we'll have you use Thunder Double Fang. And let's get you a little bit more health here. Ooh, and we win the head-to-head. -head. Poor Cheval. Dynamo's a little bit strong. And I mean, I did kind of build it to be able to murder opponents in PvP, so... Just need a Leviathan stim so that I can open up that last slot and make it even more amazing. Okay. So what else have we got? Oh, we've got plenty. But, you know, I think I'm going to take a rest right here, and then we're going to go try and deal with the double Joes. And that'll be the end of the episode, whether we win or lose. Though, I sincerely hope we win, because winning is better. Gives nice things, and it isn't losing. Besides, it's far from the worst quest in the game. Oh, and also, before we do that, we have fought some new stuff. We've also hatched some new stuff as well. So... Uh, it wasn't Sand Bear I thought I was going for. It was... Oh, right. That's what happened. I was going for Kieran out in the plains, and I got a Monoblose egg out there, so I figured, hey, I'll go to the desert and try and get more Monoblose eggs so I can get a good one worth using. That's what happened. Yeah, Monoblose have pretty decent stats. So does Seregios. Kieran doesn't know what HP is, though. Uh, yes, let's head to Pondry Hills, wherein we can find and hopefully deal with the Double Joes. Dynamo will be our weapon of choice for them, but we had better not get on him until we get to where the Joes are, because... Otherwise, we'll be moving slower than we need to be. And I prefer moving fast. Just ignoring as many of these as we can. And that's all of them. Can we start with a back attack, I wonder? Nope. Okay, I forgot to put the Moxie gem and the other thing in here, but that's okay. We know they're going to be using power almost exclusively, so we can build up a lot of kinship, and then we can make use of that kinship.
And we'll try and go for Savage Predator A as much as... Oh! You jerk! And we want to get rid of A as soon as we can, because that way we'll only have B to deal with. Because that's really the only challenge here. Wait, it... Okay, no. It's the thing that was making the I'm almost dead sounds was Dynamo. Okay, I think we gotta let this loose right now. Thankfully, that steals both of their turns. Ooh, um... We may end up losing a heart here. Okay, no, we won't. Though, having Dynamo choose wrong there definitely hurt. So, let's use a Thunder Double Fang. Or not. Let's just let Dynamo do Dynamo. Thank goodness our armor keeps us from dying once. Or rather, if we have high enough health. Okay. Dynamo, it's going for you, so... Thunder Double Fang. And me, Dust of Life. So we'll be able to hop on Dynamo, give him a nice heal here. Oh, no! Okay, we gotta let this go now, or else we'll lose it. Okay. So, Savage Predator A is nearly dead now. So we've got that going for us. As soon as it's gone, this becomes way easier. Because then we only got to heal through one of their attacks. Thunder Double Fang, you know the drill. It's a Joe. Why does it always use tech at the most inopportune times? At least it's dead now, but geez. That Joe wasn't acting very Joey. usually pretty rare to even see a Joe use tech. Alright. So, it's gonna be using pump up, I'm guessing? Yeah. That's fine. Again with the tech! What's with these Joes? So that does mean we probably won't see tech again for a little while. So I am free to just charge things up here. Okay. I. It's probably using pump up, but I can't take the risk. If it was using spread dragon breath, we would have lost that. And that's a lot of damage to just lose. And hey, we get kinship back this time. And he's almost dead, which is good. Though spread dragon breath is incoming, which is bad. Ow. Like, really ow. So, let's have you use some Thunder Double Fang here. And I'll use a Vital Essence. Sound good? It better. Oh, I guess no Vital Essence then. But hey, we did it. So next stop, Hakum, to turn in that quest. And then we'll be done with the episode. I'll take it. This is probably the best I can really expect from here. Don't want to get rid of it and get an Aptonoth instead. Because, dang it, I don't need an Aptonoth. 
like at all. And to Hakum we go. Hey, buddy, I killed our Joes. Will do. Now, I'm just going to check up there real quick make sure there's no quests for us because I think one might show up at some point but I could be wrong I could have sworn that Cheval would be up there at some point but looks like he isn't okay I kind of want to see what the Devil Joe outfit looks like on Navi I don't recall what it looked like Yeah, I'm not a fan. That's kind of silly. Interesting that we got that before the regular Rathalos. Because there is a regular Rathalos outfit as well. But I dare say that's going to be it for this episode. Join us next time when we take care of these things and maybe other stuff. See you then, friends.